the trash. Oh, don't worry, I won't. Happy birthday, Skitch. Thanks, Dad. Now go to your room. I hate the kids! No. It could mean you feel like you're not always being heard. Yes, of course. Which is perhaps why you developed a tendency to scream. Amazing. How did you know I scream? From before, when you screamed at me. <laughs> Sorry again about that. I didn't realize you were just making notes on your pad. I thought you were drawing my caricature. <laughs> Let's talk more about this issue of not being heard. Can you remember a specific incident from childhood when you felt that way? Oh, can I ever. It involves something very, very close to my heart. Hey, Arthur, do those dumb things even work? I'm looking at your skeleton as we speak. Getting those glasses was the happiest moment of my life. You mean up to that point? No, ever. <laughs> hey, Arthur, I thought Dad said you couldn't have those. Where did you get the money, anyhow? Don't tell him. I want it pitching pennies against Whitey Dugan. Damn. <laughs> Hey there, Skitchy. How's it going? Hi, Dad. Arthur? <laughs> Say, what's on your head? These are just my regular glasses. Really? They always have those spirally circled things on the lenses? Sure. Don't lie to me, boy. I can check with your optometrist. They're x-ray glasses. He bought them with the money he won pitching pennies. What? It too, Skitch. I thought I told you any money you win pitching pennies goes right to Skitchy's college fund, huh? No, it's just 15 cents, Dad. Please, Dad, don't throw them in the trash. Oh, don't worry, I won't. Happy birthday, Skitch. Thanks, Dad. Now go to your room. I hate the kids! Those glasses meant the world to me, but you couldn't hear that, could you? Instead, you had to give them to Skitch, your beloved, your golden boy. Skitch is a smart kid. He's going places. He's going to be arrested nine times for stealing women's shoes. Hey, you want to join yourself in that bedroom? You can't intimidate me anymore, Dad. Oh, God. Get back here. You want a piece of me? You're going to have to come through my psychiatrist. Ooh, what have we here? Big, fancy Park Avenue head shrinker, huh? What's the matter? Couldn't make it as a real doctor? I'm just here to observe. Oh, are you, Mary? Uh, let's get out of here. 